my name is Lexi Hennigman, a current senior and an ASV officer. It is my pleasure to show you around the campus, introduce you to all of the exciting programs that we have to offer. Welcome to Fullerton High School, one of the most diverse and exciting schools in Southern California. Our vast array of award-winning programs range from the fine arts to culinary arts, speech and debate, international baccalaureate to agriculture, and of course, our great athletics department. You know, on my first day of high school, I was nervous too, and I'm sure that you are feeling the same way, but really, you have nothing to worry about. These four years have been such a wonderful experience, and I'm sure they will be for you too. Come on, I'll show you around. One of the greatest things about coming to Fullerton High School is the amazing history that goes along with it. Take this fresco on the side of Plummer Auditorium. It was painted in 1934 by Charles Kessler, called Pastoral California. It was painted over in 1936 and wasn't uncovered until the 90s. But that's another story. Do you know how old this school is? The first graduating class was 1896. I believe it consisted of two guys. This year's graduating class, 450. You may think that 450 students is a lot, but think about this. With over 30 clubs, a wide variety of activities, and a new small learning community program, we will make you feel right at home. There is my grandpa, I think. I'm pretty sure. He doesn't look quite the same. But. <laughs> 1952. In the library, you will find a great collection of books, as well as a career center and an ROP counselor to guide you through. You're now in the main office. You don't just come here if you're in trouble. We also have two excellent counselors M through Z right here. We have A through Z right here. We have over a hundred distinguished alumni on our Wall of Fame, consisting of Hall of Fame baseball players, scientists, a president, and Leo Fender, who invented the Fender guitar. You should check it out. You know, this school isn't very small, so I've got us a very stylish set of wheels to get the tour done a little faster. All right. Let's go. Something that you guys should know, we have the freshman tree right here, and then pretty soon you're going to be at the senior corner right here. And behind it is the new science and technology building. <laughs> we are now in the secret world of journalism, and here is Amber Bissell, <laughs> the editor-in-chief, to tell us a little bit more about the Pleiades and her experience in journalism. And I've been in it for four years, and you can join at the second semester of your freshman year. And every month we have a staff meeting where we talk about what we want to put in the issue, and then we go out and we write. And then we have a production week where we go over all of the little things and we produce our paper, which is something like this. Came out today. Just came out today, yeah. And so everyone's wearing their t-shirts and so on, and we're passing them out, and it's all really fun. And we try to feature like all the different parts of the school, aspects of the school. So we like cover sports and like um, the theater program, and you know everything that everyone is doing. And um, we try to put a student spin on world issues, and we have photographers and cartoonists, and we just try to get everyone involved, and you know get everyone reading the paper, and hopefully it's really interesting. And so. Join journalism because it's really fun. So, so besides for <laughs> journalism, what else are you involved in at the school? Um, your full well, I, full IB diploma, right? Yes, I'm going full IB. So that's um, it's a it's sort of like an accelerated honors course, which is really fun. Um, it's a lot of hard work, but it's very challenging, and I've learned a lot, and I've all, I've had great teachers, and I've been able to have classes with wonderful people. And um, it's really helped me like applying to colleges and stuff because you know always taking an AP or an IB course is good. 
And um, I'm also, I did tennis, and that was really fun. <laughs> so sports are good. And the musical, I'm doing the musical this year. What are Don't, your, um, what are your and I have a really good yeah, part. Um, and also, I did theater, and theater is really good for getting, you know, if you're not very, if you're kind of shy, it helps you become more extroverted and more comfortable around people and on stage and expressing yourself. And, um, yeah. Uh, the Culinary Academy is really fun. We do a lot of different things and we learn a lot of different cooking techniques and just you learn a lot of things that you can apply in real, like the real world. Like how to manage time, how to associate with other people, what to do if things go wrong, how to improvise, and just things that you can use in other areas of your life. Water polo, it's, it's really hard but it's really fun. And swimming is really fun also. Swimming is a lot about endurance and it's more of an individual sport. And water polo is more of a team sport. And you have to be able to work well with others to play water polo or you're not really going to get along that well with everybody else. Surfing. One of America's favorite pastimes. Surfing culture is embedded all over the coast of the world. When Chiclet Forest wants a piece of this culture... I just learned a lot of stuff in speech and it just feels nice to be in a group where everybody accepts each mm -hmm. other. Very cool. Tell us about some of the um, tournaments that you guys have been to. I know you've been doing really well in those. Um, well, we've been to, we, we do travel tournaments, so we've been to Northern California, we've been to Bradley, Illinois. Um, it's really nice too because we get to see different colleges and we get to see what the atmosphere is like. Um, we also go to the local and we're like league champions, so it's always nice to have that. The nice thing about dance production is that you get to perform too in front of everybody and you really get to be creative and show what your ability and your creativity is. So it's really nice and you get to be involved with the school and like that's like really really important because you get to have different friendships and get to know and understand different people and work with them. So it's been really nice. with Michael Hicks who is going to tell us a little bit about the athletic program and his experience here at Fullerton. So, yes. you've been in football four years, four years right? Yes. And track? Track, four track. years. And I also did uh, basketball for two years and I did soccer for one year. So how, is, how has that whole experience been for you? Oh, I loved it. I mean, I had a great time. I got to meet a lot of new people. I mean, I meet like, I mean, I hang out with people now that like I would have never met if I would never played sports. So it's just like, Introducing myself, like I got to, you know, talk to people that I just I love doing. I like meeting new people and playing sports. It's what I do, right. so I love that. Yeah.